Today's video is sponsored by the Valdez Spire of Secrets Kickstarter. It's in its final week, so follow the link down below, get your ass over there and check it out before it vanishes forever. The book is amazing, the link is down below, stick around at the end of the video for more information. Prestidigitation has been called the most powerful cantrip, not because it deals a lot of damage, but because of its sheer versatility. The only limit is your creativity, but if you're not feeling very creative or you need some ideas to get the ball rolling on what's possible, just steal them from this video. Content warning, some of these are extremely unethical. You've been warned. Here are 101 uses for prestidigitation. Make it look like a noble has crapped their pants. Make it look like you haven't crapped yourself if you have a little accident. Snuff out the candles in an area to sneak by in the dark. Light a torch without matches or a tinderbox. Create a fake sigil on your clothing to gain favor with a specific group of bandits or a church. Warm up cold food. Cool down hot food. Flavor bad foods to make it taste better. Make someone's expensive meal taste terrible to stir up trouble in a bar when they start complaining. Create the scent of rotting corpses in a shop to get the town guards in and ripping up the floorboards. Useful as a distraction or just to be annoying. Make a silver coin look gold. Create the sound of muddled conversation to throw off eavesdropping NPCs. Create the sound of a circus or an ice cream vendor to get annoying children to fuck off. Create a trinket of an invitation or an entry token to gain access to places. Just remember that all trinkets only last 12 seconds, so when you use them, use them quick and move fast. Clean the blood from yourself after doing a murder to blend back into the crowd. Flavor water to taste like fine wine and set up an alcohol-free bar. Create a playing card to cheat in poker. Create a personalized signet ring that no one can steal to sign off your letters. Change your clothes colors to infiltrate an organization. Clean the blood from a fallen ally in a mark of respect. Soil the clothes of an enemy in blood to frame them for murder. Set up a window cleaning business. Create the sounds of clashing swords in another room to lure the guards away. Conjure a lockpick. Conjure a compass to find north quickly. Fake mustache. Create a mirror to peer round corners. Torture someone with the endless sound of Smash Mouth's all-star floating on the breeze. Ease the tension with a well-timed fart sound. Raise the tension with a well-timed wet fart sound. Stylishly light a cigar. Every time you take a step, a piano note plays. Create your own badum after every terrible joke. Create your own applause upon entering a room. In a contemporary setting, drive people crazy by vibrating their phone in their pockets when they don't have any notifications. Vibrations can also be used for pleasure, so enjoy that with your partner. Clean certain parts of ink from a message to alter what it says. This message says, please, don't kill the prisoner. Just take away the word, don't. Make that deadly poison taste like fine wine. Make that fine wine taste like deadly poison. Warm your clothes in cold weather, chill your clothes in hot weather. Mark the walls in a labyrinth so you can see where you've been. Change a fleeing enemy's hat and cloak to bright pink so they're easy to spot. Make distant, ghostly sounds so people think a house is haunted. Make a room smell of smoke so people believe there's a fire. Conjure up a pencil to quickly jot something down. Make a gust of wind so it feels like an arrow just flew past someone's cheek. Add the sound of the arrow bouncing off the wall behind them to add to the trick. Both of these work best at night. Snuff out a light source to plunge a battle into darkness to either escape or generate advantage if you have dark vision. Light a well-placed candle to ignite explosive traps. Soil your clothes and disguise yourself as a beggar. Unsoil them later to blend in with the higher classes. Soil a carpet by adding muddy footprints running away from the direction you ran if you're being chased. Create a small mark on the back of an NPC's cloak so the rest of your party know that you found a spy or an NPC to rob. Create dice for playing in-game D&D. Create a sheriff or police badge or a driver's license in modern settings. Create a platinum coin and push it into the hands of a guard as you move past for a quick bribe. Change the color of a flag to mess with ship-to-ship -ship communication. Create flashes and sparks to distract the crowd while your rogue does some pickpocketing. Make the sound of a buzzing mosquito and then slap a noble in the face and insist you just save them from malaria. That's probably my favorite one. Color the bars of your jail cell window so your allies know where you are to spring you out. Conjure a platinum piece, <laughs> throw it into a crowd, and laugh as they scramble for it long after it vanishes. Make dog poop smell and taste just like chocolate. Drop the spell halfway through your victim's first bite. Emergency toilet paper. 
Conjure a small pen knife for a quick stab, with all evidence of the weapon disappearing seconds later. Interject off-key notes to ruin a bard's performance. Create the image of a glyph of warding on a door to make people afraid to run through it. Add wild and unpredictable sparks to magic objects to make them look broken and insist you get a discount. Make a kick me sign appear on someone's back. Can't mess with the classics. Rustle some bushes to draw attention from your hiding spot. Create the sound of fleeing footsteps to lead your pursuers away. Jam a machine by soiling the mechanisms. Break a magic circle or glyph by soiling the intricate design. If you know what a key looks like, you can make a trinket copy to quickly open a familiar lock. Dry your clothes instantly after a swim or a thunderstorm. Create a duplicate of a king's signet ring to hide the fact that you've opened a letter. Create a shower of sparks as a signal or a warning. Put a personal mark on an item you want and claim someone stole it from you. Look, it must be mine. It's got my family crest on it. Disguise alcohol as water to get the guards drunk. Create a detailed image of someone on a piece of paper, then sketch over it. The original will disappear and boom, you're a great artist. Cheat in drinking contests. Quickly swap out a fake gold coin with a real one when handing over change to a merchant. Create a weighted die or a fake coin to cheat in parlor games. Make your cloak or hair billow dramatically as you stand. Add sparks or musical harmonies to improve a bard's performance. Color someone's glasses or telescope lens black so they can't see. Flavor your clothes to taste like elf. Now a boulette won't eat you. Seduce on the go by conjuring a beautiful trinket to give to a fair maiden. Instant graffiti to promote your gang sign or upcoming bake sale. Free perfume for you and the party. Clean the poison from a poisoned weapon before you get hit by it. Clean the blood from an altar to stop a demonic summoning. Make an exact one hour timer by creating an image. It disappears exactly one hour later. Trick the bad guy into thinking you've already stolen a precious magical item. Make a trinket copy of it and hold it high in the air and run. Clean the hinges on an old door to stop it creaking when you're sneaking around. Create a small figurine trinket of a monster or person you're tracking to show to people and ask if they've seen it. Set up a campfire and light it the second someone steps over it for a simple trap to make them jump or maybe fall prone. Create simple components for other spells, like maybe a small feather for featherfall if you ever lose your material pouch. Change the hair or skin color on a corpse to disguise its identity. Remove all traces of blood, hair, fingernails, and fingerprints from a murder scene to stop authorities collecting them and using them to scry after you and track you down. Take the Metamagic Adept feat and use Subtle Spell when casting Prestidigitation to do every single trick on this list silently so you can't be detected. And that is 101 uses for Prestidigitation, probably the most powerful cantrip. Remember to like the video, subscribe, and leave a comment down below with other awesome uses for the spell. Also, shout out once again to Valda's Spire of Secrets for sponsoring this video. It's a Kickstarter book with over 150 new subclasses, a ton of new full classes, new races, new spells, new everything. It is amazing. They've already raised over $400,000. This thing is amazing, and it is only available for one more week. You can also get a bunch of other bonus stuff by supporting at higher tiers, including these totally badass figurines they've got. They've been really nice supporting this channel. The book is genuinely amazing and they're lovely people. So, you know, check them out and show them some love. Also check out other guides and videos on this channel and I'll see you next time. Bye.